Oh my gosh, guys, I am so excited. Ah, it's here. <laughs> oh, you better believe we're doing an unboxing. I don't think that I told you guys what I ordered. Oh, but it's a big one. And uh, don't judge me for what I bought, okay? Because, you know what, some of you, some of you might understand. Okay, so this is for Zabu. If you are new to the channel, Zabu is my cat. And for the past two years, I have wanted to get him one of these. And I haven't because they're a little pricey. But I was strategic this year and remembered that I had been waiting to get one of these. And I killed the game on Black Friday. This is like half of what it would normally cost. These things are typically over $100, but I got this bad boy for 55 buckaroos. Oh my gosh. Okay, come on. It's a cat stroller. <laughs> okay, so um, typically people get their like tiny toy dogs, these little strollers. I'm assuming at some point you've seen these somewhere and they're the kind of people you look at and kind of judge because they're pushing their tiny little dog around in a stroller. And you know what? I'm one of those people now. Except I'm even lamer because I'm pushing my cat around. But, you might come see your new toy? He doesn't even know. He doesn't even know. I'm so excited. And you're gonna love it. He, he cares more about the box. Is that your box now? Oh, not so sure. Yeah, this is yours. Yeah. Anyway, when I was looking at the reviews, um, I saw a review about a lady who had bought one of these for her cat and she said that he was 18 pounds and she took pictures of him in this sitting up and laying down and he fit totally fine. So I'm quite confident that Zabu will also fit. Oh good lord, where does this go? Um, instructions? Yes. Instruction manual. Here we go. Okay, this must be the red release. Upward, locking into place. Oh, that was pretty easy. Now for the wheels. Oh, and I wanted to make sure that it was one that had just like the one on the front. So if I start getting back into jogging ever, it's a good jogging stroller. Okay, we're just gonna wing it and find out. Just gonna wing it. Come on, cooperate. Oh, I heard a click. We're in. Come on. There we go. One. All right. Wheel time. Which part of the wheel goes on? The spinny part. Out. Okay. In we go. I'm assuming I put the pin back in. And then put the other one. Okay, both wheels are on. Got me some wheel caps. Oh, whoops, my bad. Wheel caps. Boom, boom. I'm not hearing a click. Anybody else hear a click? Let's get real. Am I done? I'm not hearing a click to secure. Oh, I got one in. Did I get the other? No. Click to secure. <laughs> oh, I got one. Why don't the other one go? Ah, yes. Oh yeah. It's not going anywhere now. Okay. 
Now we go, guys. Don't worry. It's getting serious up in here. It's supposed to go under. Yes. There we go. That part was easy. Tip it over, put the screws back in. We will be good to go. All right. We're attached. Okay, side note about these little, about installing this little tray. It has these little things in the side and they're a real pain to get back in there. You have to like take it out of the metal part and then put it back through this plastic part, but then also get it through the metal at the same time and you can't see what you're doing. Ugh, annoying. Okay, so I think it's officially assembled. So now I'm just kind of like nosing about seeing what all it has. So the first thing I saw was this like back section, just so you know, this is where the stroller arm, so this is like the back of it. It like has this little mesh part so he can see like me if he wants to. And then it totally opens. So it's like super open in the back. And then, oh my God, the zipper just came off. What a piece. Oh, no, 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 it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. It's like um, it's like any zipper, like on a sweatshirt. It has the little thread right there at the top. Okay, I just about freaked out. I was like, are you serious? I just bought you. Okay, it's fine. <laughs> um, oh, also on the inside, it has like this nice little pad. Oh, look, it's got the, it's got the little uh, leash thing so I can hook him in so he doesn't get wily. It also has this under pouch down here, which is kind of nice. I can put all my crap down there when we're on our walks. This top part goes backwards and stuff. Though obviously I think that's always gonna be up and closed because otherwise he'll escape. Oh, you know what, that makes sense. I could hook, if I wanted it totally open, I could hook him to those little things and then I wouldn't have to have him like totally in here. Okay, we've got two zippers. We've got this one. There we go. And it zips forward all the way around. Nice. He's not getting out of there one season. And then also it looks like there's another zipper for this top part. Shabam. Zabu, are you excited? I'm so excited. This is gonna be great. This is gonna be great. All right. I think it's time to try it out. Okay guys, I'm gonna put Zabu in it for the first time. Are you ready? He's looking at me like, what are you up to, woman? Okay, I feel like he's not into it because he doesn't realize that he's going to get to go outside, which is his favorite thing. Okay, let's put this top over. Get your tail in there. What do you think? Huh? How is that? Work with me now, there we go. What do you think? You already like? There's a cat in there. There's a cat in there. What do you think? Hmm? I'm glad it's big enough for you. What if I open it a little bit? Hello, boo. You like? What do you think? Hmm? You're in attack mode. Rawr. Rawr. Is this your crate? I can't come in? No. <laughs> I can't come in? <gasps> okay. I'll zip you back up. Should we take this for a spin outside? What do you think? It's kind of dark. I don't know if you guys will be able to see very well. Let's go try it out. Okay guys, so I'm outside and my first thoughts are that I feel like a crazy cat lady. What do you think? He's like all hyped up right now. Do you see something? <laughs> what do you think? 
loves being outside so much. Zabu, what are your final thoughts? Hmm? I think he liked it. Can you get out? Hop down. I should probably, oh, I was just gonna say, I should probably lock the wheels, huh? My bad, sorry, boo boo. What did you think? I'm gonna unzip to see if he ever wants to, if he gets back up in it. I'm gonna lock the wheels real quick so it doesn't move anymore. Chunk, chunk. Okay, we're locked. Yeah, we're not going anywhere. Whew. Hair looks a little crazy. Oh well. Okay, so that was just my first outing. I was only outside for like five minutes. I just took him around the neighborhood. But I am in love already. He was so happy. Ugh. I have tried to take him on walks before and it's probably my own fault for not like keeping up with it, but oh, he's so slow. He has to stop and sniff everything. And I know if I would have like kept trying and whatever, he probably would have gotten more used to it. Oh my God, I'm sweating, hold on a second. Oh, okay. Um, I know if I would have kept making him practice and stuff, it would have gotten better, but I'm too impatient, so. Now this is my compromise. He gets to go outside and see all the sights and I don't have to sit there and wait to go three feet in five minutes. Anyway, I'm super happy. I love it so much. He's still inspecting it. Oh, you can get back in? Not so sure yet. I really, really love it. The zippers are a little annoying. Um, Assembly was pretty simple. I'd say most people could do it without any issues. Um, I will leave a link to the one that I got down below. Um, I found it, what was I doing? I was just doing a random Google search for uh, animal strollers and I read a bunch of reviews on all of them and like I said, I decided on this one because a lady had reviewed it for her cat, but yeah. I dig it. Zabu is 22 pounds, so he's a big boy. He's like half Maine Coon. So, yeah. And he fit comfortably in it. Like, he wasn't tight or anything. He could stand and lay down all the way, and he was good to go. So, A plus. Thumbs up recommendation for sure. Um, yeah, I mean, I'll let you know if anything goes wrong later with it, but right now it does exactly what I need it to do. Ooh, and maybe when I take him on the daylight walk, I'll keep the top unzipped and actually like have him leash down. That makes me a little nervous because he's like a master escape artist, but we'll give it a shot, see if he can be trusted. <laughs> it wouldn't be the first time I'd have to chase him down outside, so. What do you think, Zabu? Everything you ever wanted? Hmm? Well, I think he's pleased. <laughs> All right, guys, that is it for me today. If you're new to the channel, subscribe and hang out for more fun cat stroller videos. <laughs> I don't know if that's up anybody's alley, but hey, it's my life. I love my cat and I'm going to spoil him. All right, guys, I will see you tomorrow. Bye. So he's been in there since we got back, like 20 minutes ago. And he's tweaking out. He's not trapped in there. The back's open, the front's open. Oh. Good morning, guys. I just got back from the gym, and now we are in the daylight, and I will show you Zabu in his new home. What do you think, Fluff? <laughs> I brought him over to my uncle's so we could walk him and my uncle's dogs together. He's a little tweaked right now because he saw the dogs, but it looks pretty cool. What's a gato? What do you think? Hmm? He's like, oh my god, I gotta got her. It's okay, we're gonna go soon. Got my keys down there. Got my water bottle up there. 
We're good to go.